This trio of scientists at the University of Louisville's Brown Cancer Center is making substantial progress toward a goal that seemed elusive just a decade ago. Our goal um, was to develop a preventive cancer vaccine. Kavitha Yadanapudi, John Eaton, and Chi Lee are not looking to treat cancer, but to prevent it from growing. They found the vaccine they're developing works 60 to 80 percent of the time in mice. It's immune prevention. So we are basically priming the immune system against cancer so that the immune system is all armed and ready. And when the cancer starts to grow, it attacks it and prevents it from growing. The U of L team has taken a different, somewhat unique approach to develop their vaccine. Instead of using approved, live, whole stem cells like other research groups are using, they found using the unwanted material shed by those stem cells, called vesicles, works just as well. We just collect whatever waste that the cells are producing out as vesicles. These are just the cells constantly secrete these into the uh, exterior, that media that they're growing in. and. We just take those and we immunize the mice and we get the same effect. Yada Naputi says the vaccine should be safer and cheaper than others being developed. But there are still two big unanswered questions. What is that exact component that's causing the immune system to start firing up against the cancer? We still don't know that. We know that there are multiple components in those vesicles, but what are those and what is it doing inside the body to make the cancer not grow? The other question, Will it prevent cancer in humans? That is a zillion dollar question, another probably 10 years of research, but uh, we are getting closer with this vesicles vaccine that we are talking about, whereas with the whole cells, we are way far ahead. It's very encouraging for us, and we really see a future for this type of a vaccine in the cancer field because of all the supportive evidence that we have.